Hello guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm here again, okay? Thank you so much. God bless you, your family as well. Today we have here a little message to your heart, okay? Listen to me now. Genesis chapter chapter 1, chapter 1, verse 3, 4, and 5. And the text says so, the book of Moses, okay, the book that God revealed to Moses. And he says here, Mo Moses says, and God said, verse 3 and God said let there be light and there was light and God saw the light was that it was good and God divided the light from the darkness and God called the light day and the darkness he called night and the evening and the morning were the first day okay uh, verse 3 4 and 5 and God said and God said let there be light and there was light. God said, let there be light and there was light. When God speaks, something happens, okay? When God speaks, something happens. God said, let there be light and there was light. Exactly as he spake as he spoke okay and today god is speaking to you and today god is here in this message god is here in this video God is over there with you at this present moment in uh, at this present moment when you are watching this video God is with you over there and God is a wonderful God listen to this message please when God speaks, something new happens. When God speaks, something, something, something happens. And God wants to speak to you. And God wants to speak something about you, about your life, because He knows you very, very well. Okay? God said, let there be light. And there was light. And there was light. And God saw the light that it was it was good. And God divided the light from the darkness. Divide the light from the darkness. Okay. Light is all the good things in this world and in our, our life. And darkness is all the bad things in our life. All the bad things in this world, okay? I don't know if you are in this moment living in light or in darkness, but God knows everything. If your life is in real darkness today, Right now, I say to you, or better, God says to you. God says to your life right now, let there be light. Let there be light. Let there be light. And God wants, God desires to divide the light. From the darkness because he 
loves you okay listen to this message please and obey the voice of God for your life right now and forever God loves you so much think about that think about that and God can divide the darkness from the light. And God can make a difference between the light and darkness in your life today. And God desires that you have, that you have, that you live a life on earth in light not in darkness not in darkness so the light of god can shine into your heart right now right now when we live in darkness we can't see anything we can't see anything in darkness okay Physically, we can't see anything when we are in darkness. When we are in a room without light. When uh, we are in a room with no light, we can't see anything. In spiritual life is the same. In the spiritual life also we can't see anything on the other side. On the other side of the physical issues. And God is the only person only person that can that can that has the power to shine into our heart because God itself is the light. Jesus Christ said, "I am the light of the world." God is the light for you, and now He is saying to you. I want that you live your life, spiritual life, in darkness, in, uh, in light, okay? Not in darkness, but in light, okay? Pay attention, and God said, let there be light, and there was light. God only is speak. God honor speak I don't know what we need now I don't know I don't know tell to God talk to him right now at this present moment say your oh God help me please talk to me Say something good to me, please. I need you. Open my eyes, my spiritual eyes. Give me light because I am living right now in darkness. Please talk to him because he is listening to you. He can give you all the good things in this world because he is your father he is a powerful god he is a powerful father he is a lovely father and he is here talking to you he is here speaking to you at this present moment and god said let there be light and there was light if you need help, God say to you, let there be 
health to your life. Okay? Okay? Believe in Him. Believe in Him. Please. What do you need? What do you need? What is the darkness in your life right now? The darkness in your life right now can be a disease. Maybe can be a disease, but God says to you, I can heal you. I can heal you. I can hear you right now. Please believe in me. God is speaking to you. And God said, let there be light. And there was light. And God can speak to you right now. Let there be good health. Okay? Let there be good health. And you will be healed okay believe in him believe in him i don't know what is the uh, what is it what is the darkness in your life but god knows everything you need a job god says to you let it be a job for you let there be a job for you. God can help you in every moment of your life. Believe in Him. Okay? And God said, Let there be light, and there was light, and God saw the light was that it was good. It was good. Everything that God do, that God does is good, good, good. Everything that he does is good, extremely good. And God divide the light from the darkness. And God divide the good things from the bad things. And he is doing this right now in your life at this present moment because, because he loves you so much, okay? And call God called the light day and the dark and cold night, and the evening and the morning were the first day. The first day. You need a first day today. A first day with God. When God enters in your life. When God enter in your life, you will have your first day. Your first day. Okay? Your first day. God will heal you right now. And now on, it will be your first day. Okay? Believe in Him because He loves you so much. Okay? God is here and He loves you and your family. Obey to Him. Praise to Him. Glorify His name. Speak to Him. Talk to Him every day. Pray to Him. And say to Him, God, my Father, please, Please, deliver me from all darkness and give me light every day of my life. Okay? And God will hear you because He loves you so much. Thank you so much. God bless you. Bye-bye.